From VOA Learning English, this is the Economics Report. In 2009, the U.S. automobile industry was close to collapse. It was during the biggest economic downturn in more than 80 years. People stopped buying new vehicles. At the time, financial help from the government saved several auto manufacturers from closing. Now, seven years later, a reformed auto industry is open for the public to see. American auto companies are putting their vehicles on display at the 2016 North American International Auto Show in Detroit, Michigan. But there is more to see than just new cars and trucks. The biggest news at this year's auto show is not about the outside of the autos. Michael Caudill, a U.S. automotive expert, says it is what manufacturers are planning to put inside them. He says every automaker at the show is launching some form of cool technology inside the vehicles. Caudill's examples include a special type of cruise control, smart stop technology, and even 3D, that's three-dimensional, printing to print out and create the interior of your vehicle. Much of what customers will find in an auto dealer's showroom this year is at the Detroit Auto Show. This includes vehicles that are large but use little fuel. Caudill says the fuel side of the business is a big part of what automakers are doing. He says customers want to know how many miles they can get on one tank of gasoline. A tank of gasoline is much cheaper today. That is because of the worldwide drop in oil prices. In many parts of the U.S., gasoline is less than $2 a gallon. Even so, Caudill says, electric powered vehicles and motors that use less fuel are still important on the show floor. For VOA Learning English, I'm Ann Ball.